Jonathan Lee Riches Investigates. I am covering the Moscow, Idaho case. Let's talk about Kaylee. Kaylee, one of the victims, one of the four victims who were found brutally stabbed during the early morning hours of November 13th, 2022. I have a photograph of Kaylee I want to share with all of you, and then we will discuss this photo further. Check it out. So I'm told that photo of Kaylee was taken inside a business in Pullman, Washington called The Coog. C-O-U-G. The Coog. Kaylee was in The Coog sometime before she was brutally stabbed. Now, The Coog. I'm going to show you a little bit of information about this business called The Coog in Pullman, Washington. So this is The Coog located in Holman, Washington. Uh, they have a lot of photographs, Instagram photos and timeline photos. And you can see it is clear, clearly a drinking establishment with food, restaurant. This is, this is it. It's called the Coog. And Kaylee took a picture inside this place. So Kaylee, one of the victims, was in this establishment in the past. The Coog. So it is like a drinking establishment bar atmosphere. But look how close it is to Brian Kohlberger's apartments. This is Google Maps of Pullman, Washington. You can see the distance between Brian Kohlberger's Steptoe Village Apartments and the Coog. The Coog Restaurant. The Coog is located right here on Northeast Colorado Street. And this is the Steptoe Apartments. Steptoe Village Apartments. It is a three minute drive, 19 minute walk one mile away one mile away so very 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 close step toe apartments the coog one mile away was brian kohlberger ever in the coog how often did kaylee go to the coog i mean she went there at least once was that a spot she frequent and is that a spot where brian kohlberger ever went in and maybe found or saw kaylee maybe had an interaction with her at the coog Going through old photographs of Kaylee, seeing if there's any ties whatsoever to Brian Kohlberger, looking at all the four victims. And right now, there is like no confirmation of any ties be between Brian Kohlberger and the four victims. But he had to, I'm assuming he had to see or interacted with the four victims, one of the four victims prior. Um, it's very hard to think that it was just a random act. And that's in my opinion. What is your opinion? What's your thoughts? You know anything about the Coog? You know anything about Kaylee being in the Coog? Do you know anything about Brian Kohlberger being in the Coog? Subscribe to my channel. Like, hit the notification button. I am covering this case. Idaho 4. No stone left unturned. How did Brian do this crime? Why did he do this crime? Did he know the victims prior? I'll be posting more videos soon. Stay tuned. God bless.